If it were up to me, I would try to forget the Hunger Games entirely. Never speak of them. Pretend they were nothing but a bad dream. But the Victory Tour makes that impossible. I will have to travel from district to district to stand before the cheering crowds who secretly loathe me, to look into the faces of the families whose children I have killed. make this whole process more simple. We agree not to lie to one another. Tell me what you think. We're headed for District 13, but it's nothing but rubble. We've all seen the footage. Back home, we think they keep reusing the old footage because the Capitol can't show us what's really there now. enough to leave before. I don't see how one uprising in District 8 does anything but make it more important that we leave. Don't you see? It's not about saving us anymore. Not if the rebellion's begun. You and Peter should have a lot of warming up to do before showtime. I know. The audience expects a pair of lovebirds who just won the Hunger Games, not two people who can barely look each other in the eye. But I feel as if I did know Rue, and she'll always be with me. Everything beautiful reminds me of her. I see her in the yellow flowers that grow in the meadow outside my house, and in the mockingjays up in the trees. But most importantly, I see her in my sister, Prem. Thank you for your children, and thank you for the bread. Third quarter quell. On this, the 75th anniversary, as a reminder to the rebels that even the strongest among them cannot overcome the power of the capital. The male and female tributes will be reaped from. TikTok, 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 this is a clock.